So you've got a 2007 PT Cruiser. Your oil pressure light went on. You don't know what the problem is. It could be a few things. One of the most common issues with the PT Cruiser is the oil pressure sensor, also known as the oil pressing sending unit. Oil pressure sending unit? Yeah, you know what I meant. This is a PT Cruiser. This is what the oil pressure sending unit looks like. You're gonna want a deep oil socket so you can just slide it right over and unratchet it loose. Once it's loose, you may be able to undo it with your fingers. The oil pressure sensor or the oil sending unit is located right down there. You can actually see it. It's that white thing right down there. Or you can see it sometimes a little better from this side. The phone light wouldn't work. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to reach down there with my socket wrench in the 1 16th inch socket. Okay, to replace the oil pressure sending unit, you're going to want to first undo this boot. It requires just a simple flat head screwdriver. You loosen up this hose clamp. That will allow it to slide right off of your intake manifold. Now you're going to want to undo your clips, like so, and like so. That will pull this whole entire box right off. Watch out, right there is a sensor. It's always a sensor with these things. Now you can actually probably see what that oil sending unit looks like. Right there. Do you see that red tab? So the red tab will be slid this way. You're going to want to pull that red tab upward like that which will allow you to push this button right there's a button you have to push that button in order to break this off and that's how it looks see this red tab this will normally be slid that direction which will lock it another quick tip you are going to want to put an extension on that deep well socket because there's not enough room if you don't it gives you a lot more room to put a little extension on there that's going to help you all out a lot by the way Once you hit that Loctite or those thread, the threads that are coated with that Loctite, you're going to want to bust out that wrench again. But that is the oil sending unit right there. For basically the final step here is to refit our wiring harness. That locked it in. Thank you all for watching this episode. Please subscribe to this channel if you want to see more auto repair videos from me or anything that may come up in the future that I've already done. If it makes it simpler by watching me, you definitely wanna hit that subscribe button and give me a big thumbs up because I might've just saved you a little bit of money and uh, I appreciate all your support. Thank you again.